Hi everybody, Brendan from c21teaching.com.au here. In today's Flip to Teach professional learning video, we're going to focus on a tool that's available within Google Suite called Version History. Now, one of the fears that a lot of teachers have about using things like Google Docs, Google Sheets, and Google Slides is uh, for group, group work is what if one student accidentally deletes a whole bunch of work or overwrites another student's part of that um, particular piece of work. There is a way of finding out who's done what and getting around that and restoring previous versions. So let's jump across to a Google Doc. Now this is a fairly blank Google document at the moment. Um, you can see it's just got a uh, stack of lorem ipsum text in here to use for demonstration. But this is a document that's being shared, being accessed by another person. And you can see that up here in the uh, top right hand corner, it's got the A and you will be able to see here the pink cursor that indicates who that person is. I've also got that person's screen open just here, and we can see what they're doing here as well. Now, one of the challenges, let's pretend, let's come in as the other person and I'm going to delete this text. Come back to the main version, you can see that text just disappeared down the bottom there, but I've now gone, oh my goodness, that text is gone, I need it to come back, what do I do? I can't undo it, the other person's uh, not at school, they're at their home, working on it at home. If I click on File, choose Version History, I can then click on See Version History. It brings up a list of each time the document's been accessed. So far this document's been accessed twice. Uh, once today, just by myself, and then again a second time today by myself and the other person. Now, at the moment, it's just giving me the overview. The different colored text represents the different person who input that text, and you can see that just here. However, if I click on this um, arrow, it gives me a drop-down box, which gives me more specific information about when changes have been made and who made. So the current version, just here, and you can see that there's the text that uh, was deleted, and you can see who's made that particular change. As you go back, you'll be able to see further changes as well. Now you can see at the top that there's a button that says restore this version. That means that if you work out which is the version that you actually need to keep, you can restore that version and that will then become the live document. So if I find oh, this is the one that I want, I can click on restore this version. Are you sure? It will prompt you to confirm and it will then restore that. So if I jump back across to the other screen, that will have been restored to the same version that this document is working. Now that feature is available across the Google Suite apps. That's the version history feature within Google Suite. I hope this has been useful. Don't forget for more helpful FTPL videos to visit c21teaching.com.au. Thanks for watching.